We know that heart is a part of the blood circulatory system and probably the most important part as it is the part and organ that produces and pumps blood into your body. Now, do you know what is the size of your heart? It is the size of the fist that you make. You know what is the size of a blue whale's heart? It is the size of a mini golf cart. Isn't that really big? Now, the heart is a muscular organ which is present in the center of your chest between the two lungs and its narrow end is pointed towards the left side. The heart pumps blood throughout one's life. Before understanding how the heart can pump blood, let us understand its structure first. First is the outer covering of the heart. As you can see here, the heart has a double walled membranous covering called the pericardium. Now in between these two walls is present a pericardial fluid which actually acts as a lubricant so that there is no friction when your heart is beating. The heart has four chambers. The upper two auricles or atriums that is the left atrium, the right atrium and the lower two ventricles, the left ventricle and the right ventricle. The auricles receive blood from the body and pump it into the ventricles. The ventricles send the blood to long distances such as the toes, feet and even the brain. Now there are two blood vessels entering the heart. These blood vessels enter the right atrium which is here and these are called the anterior vena cava and the posterior vena cava. They carry deoxygenated blood. The anterior vena cava will get deoxygenated blood from the upper part of your body which is above your heart like the brain, chest and arms. The posterior vena cava will get deoxygenated blood from the lower part of your body which contains your abdomen, gut and the legs. Now, the blood vessels leaving the heart are pulmonary artery which arises from the right ventricle and the iota artery which arises from the left ventricle. Iota is also the biggest artery present in your body. So what have we learned today? We learned about the structure of the heart, its four chambers, the auricles, the ventricles and the blood vessels entering the heart and leaving the heart. So, until next time, happy learning!